Now, in recent years, uh, Radhika, CCTVs have played a very huge role when it comes to solving crime. Now, it can also help prevent crime if you start using AI and that is something that our next story is all about. Absolutely. Let's meet the man who has installed the maximum number of CCTV cameras across the country, which is more than 12 lakh. Uma caught up with this individual. God we say is omniscient and in today's era, CCTV cameras are omnipresent. So you are being watched wherever you go. I'm here at Hyderabad based Brihaspati Technologies and I have with me the managing director Mr. Rajshekar Papolu, you are one of those who is ensured that uh, whether it is the national borders, whether it is elections, whether it is examination centers or national parks, everywhere people are being watched because you have installed more than 12 lakh cameras. Right now, I believe uh, the Maharashtra exams are also going on, the competitive exams are going on. How do you do this and how are you incorporating AI into this? Uh, yes, madam. We got a great opportunity to do all these projects. Like uh, we, the screen which you are seeing, like uh, it's a Maharashtra Common Entrance Examination Test, where we installed uh, about 6,000 plus cameras across uh, eight states. Likewise, we have uh, earlier we installed uh, uh, like surveillance for uh, this uh, Telangana Intermediate Board examinations. We installed more than 13,000 plus cameras, and before that, like we had done lot of projects related to this surveillance. Like for the last 2024 elections, we have installed uh, more than uh, one and a half lakh cameras in eight states and uh, coming to this border security force we have installed uh, cameras in a majority uh, like uh, most most vulnerable borders like pakistan and bangladesh uh, those are visuals of the borders that we are seeing yes, yes how was artificial intelligence also incorporated into the technology so that we can understand uh, what is happening there and uh, helping our security forces? Like a uh, few of the analytics, we implemented a group uh, group of people coming nearer to border. It gives a siren and alarm kind of thing. And uh, like uh, if some object is thrown to borders, like it will detect and uh, recognize. Uh, likewise, we have implemented loitering detection, border cross detection. Likewise, we have implemented several analytics uh, features to prevent these borders. So like, even in uh, national parks, I understand you have... Uh, these cameras what is the function there this is the kaziranga national park visuals that we are talking about yeah kaziranga national park we installed more than like uh, uh, 200 plus cameras where the main intention of these cameras is to prevent uh, these animals from uh, illegal poaching and uh, uh, like prevent animals from uh, this uh, like uh, accidents and all because nh 37 is going in between kaziranga forest upper forest and lower forest while crossing these uh, animal corridor cord there is a uh, like a prone accident prone areas uh, to be Id like identified by the department officials and whenever the uh, animals come into the uh, national highways it gives a alert at the like uh, driveway uh, uh, across the driveway it gives the alert like uh, stating that animal are bored so people will go maintain a normal speed to uh, protect uh, uh, prevent these accidents from uh, for these animals Hyderabad itself has a reputation of having the maximum uh, number number of uh, uh, cameras and uh how are you incorporating artificial intelligence even in those because very often now we say okay in crime analysis or for the police investigation it is helping but is does it have a role in uh, you know crime prevention as well detection and what are you showing there the what monitor that uh, we are shooting earlier like uh, cameras are used for a post-mortem purpose if some incident happens like they'll go through that recordings and what is happened where it is happened likewise they used to use these cameras for but now we are adding a brain to the cameras where we are implementing a lot of analytic features like uh, to prevent uh, all these uh, incidents like for example a, a driver uh, driving a bus if he is uh, like uh, uh, if he is driving the bus by using his mobile, there is a probability of uh, more uh, accidents and all. To prevent that, a camera will watch the driver and whether he is sleeping or he is yawning, like uh, the complete uh, detection will be done through the camera and alert will be raised, like uh, to the command control center as well as uh, for the driver, uh, we will uh, alert him through voice prompts.